seriously a hard climb in Thailand, and it ranks as the number 57 in the world. So we woke up early to head to Doi Intanon, was the first climb. It was so hot. The start of the climb was super rolly, and then just descend, and it was really super mellow. We stopped, uh, our awesome guide Ging showed us a, kind of gave me the creeps, uh, the shivers a little bit, but a big red ant uh, nest kind of thing in that leaf. We it's also saw thousands of ants. I, I pulled two of them out of my bike shoe like a mile and a half up the road. They uh, gave me a little, a little bite. So he said kind of a local, not necessarily superstition, belief, kind of like a Groundhog's, Groundhog's Day, thing. similar kind of thing is uh, if the... Ants build their nests uh, high up in the trees, then it means that there's going to be a pretty calm year for storms because uh, that means that the ants know that they're not in danger of getting their nest. And if they build their nest lower down in the lower limbs of the tree, then that means the locals prepare for a uh, stormy season. having a hard time with my 34-34 combo. Man, it was just steep and it was hot. I mean, it was a hard climb. Actually, we went and stood on the exact highest point in Thailand, which was pretty cool. If you get there, uh, be prepared to start early, try and beat the heat, and then be prepared for it to be super hot anyway. <laughs> and just, I got I got sunburned. He said that... Uh that the best time to go is October to April. Yeah, he you said know? it was, uh, that's when lots of stuff is growing. Up at the top, there was these cool kind of stone stairs leading around from the burial site to the, uh, the sign for the highest point. And Ging says in the that time period, starting in October, it's all covered in really bright, luscious green moss, which would have been super cool to see. But, I mean, I can't imagine it being any greener than it was. Just beautiful lush we also saw there was some waterfalls along the side of the climb Get ready to uh, to suffer a little bit. <laughs> 